what boys could go out with, right? We're going to speak about going out with certain, certain types of a string, a knot, and a bell. So, little kids, right? They go out with these kshadim, kshadim, a little, it's a little like a knot, but the Talmud explains that it would be for kids who had a, you know, an extra love for their parents, and it was a hard time for him to separate from his dad. So his dad would take the shoe from his, the, from his, the, the shoelace from his right shoe, and tie it to the kid's left wrist, right? And we'll tie a little piece of a shoelace to the, to the child's left wrist. And this would be a sigula, uh, um, you know, for this child, um, you know, as you, you know, as he's parting with his uh, dad, if he wants to go out or not. Right? The children of kings could go out with bells. Right? Not just the children of kings who go out with bells, right? It's going back on this part of the Mishnah. Rather, any person is allowed to go out. Chamim spoke in the present tense of what would what was the norm, right? That the, the children of uh, kings would go out with these uh, bells, but really anybody is allowed to go out with these bells on Shabbat.